Once upon a time, there was a civilization that was far superior and more sophisticated than we could ever imagine. This civilization was systematically destroyed and hidden from our history books. This civilization used atmospheric energy to obtain electricity. Having free energy meant that humanity could focus on more serious endeavors such as creation, creativity, love and self-development. We see these same geometric, beautiful buildings all over the world from Africa to China to Japan to South America to Europe. These buildings show us that we lived in an interconnected culture, a culture that understood the deeper levels of existence and how to harness electromagnetic energy. History is a lie and a story built by our oppressors to continue to keep us enslaved. But we will rise again. You guys ready for the hard truth, red pill? Yeah. This is a cathedral, also known as a cathedral. You see, the elite use these cathedrals, aka cathedrals, which produce free energy by pulling it in from the ether, and they are able to have free energy in their big structure buildings with this technology that they keep from us, making the rest of the city pay for PG&E, paid gas and electric. Wait, so they don't pay and get it for free, for free, for free with these cathedrals, which they stole, and make us pay? Wow, we're working like robots when we shouldn't have to if we all just had cathedrals. Well, here's a beautiful picture of the old world. Look at under this Paris Eiffel Tower and look at that one. What, what changed between 1900 and 2016? That's beautiful. This is the Palace of Electricity and the Water Castle in Paris, 1900. St. Louis, Missouri, 1904. So much electricity being produced freely in 1901 in New York. Magnetism free. Electricity costs. Yep. In the 1900s, this lady is clearly on a mobile phone. And the astonishing thing is, the lady in the video, her family recognized this video and indeed confirmed that she was using a wireless device. 